Yes, I mean, I think if you compare uh, the, the way in which I think the West uh, uh, looked at, at the BRICS when it was first uh, established uh, uh, more than a decade ago, 50, 15 years ago, I think uh, that uh, that perspective and that approach has really shifted, and we've seen it in, in a very fundamental way in terms of the amount of interest that, it's gen that this summit has generated in the West um, uh, very, very clearly. Um, I think... Certainly, from uh, from from South Africa's perspective, this was also the first uh, summit um, that happened in person uh, uh, post uh, post the pandemic, and I think it 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 was a uh, certainly you know South, South Africa sees this as as a great diplomatic um, success, the ability to bring together not just uh, the BRICS nations but also um, uh, many and numerous African heads of state, which of course is not the first time that South Africa has reached out in the context of the BRICS, as well as other uh, global South partners. And then, of course, to be uh, to be the summit at which the second um, expansion of the uh, uh, of the BRICS right. the BRICS happens.